And now they're all in. Off and racing, a good start for this field of six. Now, who wants the lead? It is Nimble Beast, who's being sent to the front end, right to his outside. Dalton coming up in between horses, Johnny Ritt and Chain Reaction. Then in on the rail is going to be Little Harbor. And it's a long way back to Super Flyover as they make their dash down the back stretch. It is Nimble Beast. He has a length and a half over a wall of horses, including Little Harbor. Super Flyover still at the back of the pack. But in between horses is Johnny Ritt and Chain Reactions backing right off of that. Also Dalton right to the outside. On the front end, it is Nimble Beast. Nimble Beast, Johnny Ritt making his move right to his outside. Dalton backing off a little bit. Little Harbor then back to Chain Reaction. And still at the back of the pack is Super Flyover. As they make their way through the turn, Nimble Beast is trying to make every call a winning one. Three horses chasing him in behind. There's Dalton on the outside in the yellow and maroon blinkers. Then in between horses, Chain Reaction in on the rail. Little Harbor being asked for a little bit more. And as they hit the top of the stretch, the half went in 46 flat. They are cooking on the front end. Michael Sanchez asking Nimble Beast for a little bit more, and he is responding. Super Flyover making up some ground from off the pace. He is flying, trying to come up the rail, but they all have to get to Nimble Beast. Less than the 16th to go, and he is striding clear. Four wins on the day for Michael Sanchez, Little Harbor finished second, followed by Chain Reaction in third, and Super Flyover in fourth. Final time of 112 and 4. Hold all tickets until race eight is official.